this is a very interesting topic. I found a study that demonstrated that you can actually reduce your liver fat by almost 50% in just two weeks. And I'm not kidding. This is not a joke. This is a credible study. There was a 14-day intervention study putting people on a carbohydrate-restrictive diet. This is called a ketogenic diet, where they consumed less than 30 grams of carbohydrates per day. And this demonstrated decreased liver fat by 43.8%. So it's not actually 50%, but it's close in subjects with obesity and NAFLD. What is that? Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Now, there's several other interesting things about this. Number one, there wasn't much weight loss. On average, there was only like a 1.8% weight loss, which is pretty insignificant. And there was no change in waist circumference. Now, this is very good information to know because if you start a ketogenic diet and you lost hardly any weight the first week and there's no change in your waist, you might just quit and think it's not working. But apparently, the body gets rid of liver fat and organ fat as a priority before it goes after other types of fat. And apparently the loss of liver fat was due to decreased something called de novo lipogenesis. What is that? That means there's a greatly reduced conversion from carbohydrates to fat. It was like a 79.8% decrease. So no longer are we getting this conversion from carbohydrates to fat. And there was also an increase in actual overall fat burning called it fatty acid oxidation by just under 5x. So we had this five times greater fat oxidation or fat burning effect in the liver. Amazing. Now there's some also very interesting additional things on this study. First of all, the participants did not lower their calories. The average amount of calories per day was over 3,000. So this was not a low calorie diet. There was also significant lower markers for liver damage significant lower fasting insulin levels and lowered HOMA IR, which means there was less insulin resistance. There was improved insulin sensitivity. There was lowered liver inflammation and there was a rapid increase in folate producing bacteria and folate in their blood. So apparently in the ketogenic diet, your microbes make more folate. Now, what is up with this folate? What does the folate do in relationship to your liver? Well, it improves liver fat metabolism and it keeps liver inflammation on the low side. And they found 94 bacterial strains were altered after going on this low carb diet with major shifts in microbes occurring just in one day. If you're new to my channel or you're not new, you've been watching my videos and you haven't started ketogenic diet, I think this right here is a good enough reason to get started right away. So I put a link down below of the exact version of the ketogenic diet you need to start immediately. Check it out. Before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today. Hey, before.